case experience and international literature show that common indicators across whatever sector or whatever country exist where there are cartels. The Competition and Markets Authority in the UK wanted to find a practical way of sharing this knowledge and experience with procurers to help them spot and stop cartels, strengthening their procurement processes and saving the public money. So we worked with a company called Spend Network to agree indicators to look for and they developed some algorithms for us. We worked with a number of local authorities in the UK who let us test the tool on their data. We're hugely grateful to everyone who helped us in this project and we now have a freely available tool that procurers in the public sector and also in the private sector can download and use to test their data for signs of cartel activity. The tool focuses in three main areas. It looks at the number and pattern of bidders. It looks at suspicious pricing patterns and also tries to identify low endeavour submissions. It's all freely available on the CMA website. We've decided to make the tool freely available for procurers to use themselves rather than hold the tool as a CMA uh, tool for us to use ourselves. And this helps us get around some problems we've experienced with data, data sharing. But we also hope that by putting the tool in the hands of procurers, it will help build a user community. And this will help spread awareness of the risk of cartels and the knowledge of how to spot and stop them. And we also hope it will create a deterrent effect. We acknowledge that the tool isn't perfect, it's a stepping stone and it's our first attempt to do this kind of work, but and it has its limitations, but we're very confident that the process of developing and distributing the tool itself has also brought real benefits. I'm confident that we've raised general awareness of the risk of cartels and we're starting to make inroads in helping procurers uh, develop the knowledge to spot and stop bid rigging where it occurs. <laughs>